and welcome back to 190 North on Chicago's beautiful lakefront. You know, it isn't summer without America's favorite pastime. And boasting not one, but two major league baseball teams, Chicago is one of the biggest baseball towns around. And now a minor league club has kicked off its inaugural season in a glitzy new stadium in Rosemont. Well, who better to show us all the excitement that is Chicago Dogs baseball than our own Dion Miller with this Let's Play. Janet, this is a sight to behold. I'm talking about the $60 million impact field. If you drive down 294, you can't miss it. And fans wasted no time coming out to support the newest team in town, the Chicago Dogs. It's all about family entertainment, good baseball, but it's also helping these young players fulfill a dream and do it right here in Rosemont and impact field. Sean Hunter is one of the team's owners who is turning both the players' dreams and those of the Rosemont mayor into a big reality. Started with a, a little blurb out there with the Cubs, and it just kept making us think, why not, why not? The team name fell right into place. Baseball and hot dogs go together. You put that in Chicago, and you got a winning combo. So Chicago Dogs, that was really the only name we ever considered. What better mascot than a condiment with some attitude? Go catch up on a Chicago dog. Offer up lots of great food options, including, of course, hot dogs. These are served up at the ballpark's own outpost of Chicago's famous Wiener Circle. Sign up a roster of ambitious young talent, and you indeed have all the makings of America's favorite pastime. And any diehard Cubs fan will certainly recognize one of the names in the lineup, Sean Dunstan Jr., following in his father's footsteps. It's an opportunity for me to play baseball and do what I love doing. The Dogs are a part of an independent league, and their skipper is no stranger to the game. Butch Hobson played and managed in the big leagues and likes what he's already seeing on the field. They play hard. They give a good effort every day, and, uh, you know, we're going to build this thing into a championship caliber team. But it's not just about the players. The Chicago Dogs are very much about their fans. One of our missions is to create fan appreciation day every night. They do that with tickets as low as nine bucks, a kid zone that's just for their pint-sized fans, and players happy to meet them. There's not a bad seat in the house. I'm loving everything about it. Impact Field also boasts six different party decks, one overlooking the Miller Lite bullpen. Another features these corner terraces, and high above the third base line is the Liney Lodge, complete with flat screens, furniture, and a bird's eye view. This cannot be beat. The party deck is great. By far one of the best seats in the house is here in the field suite where the garage doors open. You can take in the game action at field level. Then you can even step up to the plate in the team batting cage, take swings during the game. And who better to give me pointers at the plate than the manager himself? There it is right there. Woo. Perfect. Your contract. You got a contract. Oh, <laughs> Sign me up. You can check out the Chicago Dogs this season from now until September. And if you want more information about how to get tickets, log on to our website, 190north.com. Click on sections, then shows, then specials. Now, if the temperature rises above 90 and you just can't bear the heat, don't fret. Our resident expert of fun, Mark Nelson, has a preview of some places that look pretty cool and inviting. Watch this. They say history repeats itself. So when I heard there was a venue filled with darts and dartboards, I had to check out Flight Club. Flight Club is darts, but darts not as you know it. First of all, it's the most incredible food and beverage hospitality experience with darts, but technology that's baked in with the darts, whereby you play these games in groups which are going to handhold you through this incredibly immersive gameplay experience. It appeals to everybody because it, it cuts to the raw, competitive, socializing spirit that people love to engage with when they, when they go out. This is the Aki. It rhymes with hockey. This where actually indicates in traditional darts the throw line, um, but here it actually indicates all of the furniture, the booth, the space you get with your reservation. This is our proprietary social darts technology, both here and here. You have a screen above the board, so if you want to play, you just hit start. Offering four different games, this complex boasts a spacious design perfect for corporate outings or girls' night out. 
To top it off, the food and beverage menu is exceptional, with their tower filled three stories high with every seafood imaginable. King crab, some poached lobster, shrimp, oysters, uh, some calamari salad. The tasty choices are the perfect complement to a night full of old-fashioned fun and laughter. Most of us have probably played shuffleboard at one of your local bars, but here at Royal Palms, they take this game to the next level. In Chicago's Bucktown neighborhood is Royal Palms Chicago, a 21 and up venue boasting walk on shuffleboards. This concept is receiving much fame thanks to loyal fans of the sport. The shuffleboard is a, a really fun game that came over to America in 1913 on cruise ships from England and was played mostly by, by older folks down in Florida. In 2011, Jonathan and I went down to Florida on a trip and we fell in love with the game and now we have two giant shuffleboard clubs. got a seven I have to get on the board or knock her off no pressure I got this Good try. anybody of any skill level can play it I was a beginner too I had never played it before so it's just fun easy to pick up everyone here is ready to have a good time it's an easy sport anyone can pick it up it's a great time I recommend it to everybody here they have a rotating food truck what that means every time you come you can try something different but every time it's gonna be delicious Bob Earl and Sam we should make this as a flight you can get Bob Earl and Sam so if you come alone you got three friends that, that's <laughs> and you guys are my two new friends let's do a drink to it's the Royal Palms the Royal Palms. Cheers. Hey, Mark, fun times. You know, both places are open daily, and if you want more information about them, just go to our website, 190north.com. You can find it there. Still to come on our show, we are going to visit a retail location in the South Loop that offers a variety of custom artwork and accessories at a very reasonable cost. So we'll be right back. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.